deep for Maribel is Noah Vaughn, and they will kick away from him. They're turning it right up the middle and finding some room down the left side. Great field position for Maribel. Goes Cannon Johnson. Kid. Maribel also loves to work the tight ends. And they'll give it to Vaughn early. He finds room off left tackle and will pick up nine yards. Clemmer, hands off inside, and there's Steven Souls. He just beat his man and then took out Vaughn for the snap. Athletically, ninth play of the drive. It's a third down and 11. They'll pitch this one out. Vaughn to the outside, and he'll be buried at the 36-yard line. What a stop by the Powell defense. Okay, okay. But I, was, I was about to say, you've got a sophomore quarterback on the other side getting his first start. We'll take a break right here. Football down at the six-yard line. Maybe. The I would rather have to find playmakers than offensive linemen, so I think that's not a bad thing. Inside handoff again off left tackle. They'll get the first down. And a little bit more out past the 20 at our cemeteries across Knoxville. First down and 10, Noah Vaughn off left tackle. Quick footwork out to the 45-yard line. Shifty and receivers top of your screen, inside handoff, shot out of a cannon. Here's the speed. Magdo's trying to cut him down, and he will inside the 15, but not until after a huge gain by the Virginia commitment, Noah Vaughn. Clemmer, the quarterback, fakes the handoff, looks to throw, rolls left, and just gets rid of this football. There are no flags down. And you would expect Marable to send Take the, the field three. goal. Football down at the 18, a 28-yard field goal attempt to give Marable the lead, and it will go through. So the Rebels score first off. Call that a gain of one. Young quarterback rolling out, will escape, has nowhere to go with the football, and he finds Aiden Green. And Green will be quickly taken down on a nice tackle. Clemmer here with the bubble screen throws this one out. A broken tackle down the sideline and a first down. The quickness of DJ Gillens for a first down. Yeah, and, and DJ is, is <laughs> first down, handoff to Vaughn right up the middle. Quick feet still running down inside the 10. A gain of 11 yards and first down and goal for Mary. And with that, Clemmer will roll right, looking for his tight end. Nobody there. The receiver breaks free. Touchdown. Beautiful throw by Clemmer. Fits it into a tight win window to Caleb Dunford. And, uh, eh, seven, maybe eight coming up right here. Got to get the ball to Aiden Green. They've got it to him once. And, and there's a sack. He, he just throws it threw behind it down. him. That's either intentional grounding or a fumble. They've well, got to was, decide what they want to call this. They'll call incomplete pass. Well, it was not incomplete pass. I mean, he tosses it behind his back. <laughs> yes, he would. Third down and one. They'll go back inside. Vaughn gets the first down and then some. Vaughn into the secondary. Carrying defenders inside the 20. And a gain of... Now the one you run school power. Inside handoff, they will not get the first down. Only a gain of uh, two yards, so fourth down and six. You, you tell your guys just let them kick because you're still within two possessions. A 35-yard field goal from the left hash for Corbin Price. Kick is up, and it is no good. For COVID, sophomore year playing with super restrictions. Last year you had no stadium. This year you had no stadium. That's your four years of high school soccer eight years. Football comes loose, and Marable comes up with the football, and that's what happens. We have seen this movie before. Marable football field. Joe, how many first downs do they have? Maybe two, one. Clemmer yeah, looks to throw, gets it to Vaughn out of the backfield, and this is just Noah Vaughn being Noah Vaughn. 18 yards, however, is there a flag?
Apparently there is no flag. The set back here just we're okay getting the first down and punting and that type of thing. It doesn't matter how young you are. Or how Inside handoff to the outside, finding the gap, running over defenders out to the 45-yard line, a gain of 17 yards and gives the crowd something to cheer about. Connor Wheeler that time getting out. Apollo doesn't get it. Clemmer looking to throw. What a grab. What a grab. Is that the Iris Network's connection of the game? DJ Gillens goes high in the air, and he's only five. Draw play. Nope. Third down and 15. Clemmer feels the pressure, throws this one out, and he is down. They'll let him keep running. I thought the knee was down. And it doesn't matter. That will take us to halftime. Correct. Inside handoff, trying to get to the outside, using some speed. And they took two or three yards. Noah Vaughn. See, that's where he looks like Eric Gray. That's, that's where he looks like Eric Gray. The, foot, the footwork for the 30-yard touchdown where he just breaks your ankles and then says, see ya. You're right. That's exactly where it looks like. Otherwise, he actually runs. Right, by the way, as they lost 13 yards on that drive. Good snap back. Kick is away. And Aiden Green misplayed this one. But Connor Wheeler says, I got it. And he's off. Headed in the opposite direction. First time they crossed midfield tonight. State champion Justin Underwood. They got their rings. In. Still waiting on mine. After all I've done for him over the years, he owes me. Connor nice Wheeler. Play. Yeah. Shifty. Sliding in. Picking up the first. Young quarterback looking to throw. Steps up. Aiden Green across the middle. Did he make the catch? He says he did. And the Josh Frisco say says he did. He did as well. Inside handoff, off left tackle, following blockers, looking for the end zone, and... Oh, I think he got in. Yes, sure. Second down and goal inside the one. Go right, right off this right side, they're not ready. Connor Bounce Wheeler, it right. following blockers, in the end zone, touchdown. He put his nose down and, and barreled in, and the lights go out at Powell. Lights have gone out. Are they gonna? They're gonna do any colors, or we just turn them off? Well, they're colors. I, I'm just saying, like that's more of a warning thing to me. You got to warn before yeah. you just. I mean, I, I, I'm not saying it's not a wrong, a, 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 wrong, a bad call because it could be by the letter of the law. I'm just going off of like it just seems like you get a warning. There's no warning here, Kane. Him again after the PAT or after the uh, the penalty was assessed, that was okay. But anyway, it's a it's a teachable moment nonetheless, right? Here, here's here's an old four wide side of the field, the near side. They'll keep it on the ground, get the first down inside the 15, inside the D1 red zone. Clemmer inside handoff, nice job by the Powell defense at the line of scrimmage. Second down and 13 at the 17 yard line, 24 to six. Maryville with the lead. Clemmer oh, across like the it. middle, catch is made. Oh, nice. And oh. I thought he was gonna be able to stay upright and get in. They'll call him down at the four yard line. They love to work those, those tight ends. Good look at Houston Ratledge on the offensive line and Noah Vaughn will follow him for yet another touchdown off left tackle. As Maribel starts to pour it on up 30 to 6 with the extra point to come. Austin was all about the meatloaf. Nice pass here to Aiden Green. There's the spin move. And that's why he's a Cincinnati commit. Nice move down to the 35 yard line. A nice pickup of 30 yards by Aiden Green.
First down and 10 at the 35, right up the gut. Oh, into the Wheeler. secondary, breaking tackles goes Wheeler. He'll turn down inside the 20 to the 16 yard line. 19 yard gain for Connor Wheeler. Wide side of the field, the near side. First down and 10 at the 17. They'll throw this one out. Lead block down to the 10 yard line. Flag comes in from behind. Harold getting switched over to Adidas. We didn't have delays getting the quartery. Didn't have any delays getting screen print because they do all that themselves. Aiden Green across the middle. He will look for the end zone and find it. 30 yards out for Powell. And his second big catch of this drive. Pretty good pass, by the way. First down and 10 at the 45. Clemmer takes oh, a shot. Yeah. Receiver is there. Oh, knocked away beautifully by Aiden Green. Yeah, and he's been grabbing with that left calf. Yeah, line. he has. Yep, side handoff. And there's Souls again on the tackle, I believe. Something. Off left tackle, shot out of a cannon. There's Noah Vaughn again, quicker than a hiccup, and taken down by Aiden Green. Inside handoff, Price Davis, and he will find the end zone untouched. Touchdown Rebels with 5-10 to go, 37-13, extra point to come. I like that Catholic game right here. Tom Regan kind of test you right before the playoffs. Connor Wheeler, here he goes again. Right before we go. Ken Sparks explained that to me years ago. First down and 10 at the 32. Stitzberry looks to throw. Intercepted across the middle. And the Rebels now down the sideline. And now they consult it away as there will be all kinds of cheering as the lineman comes up with the interception. Zach Gone. New quarterback in the game for the Rebels. Casey Cobble. Second down and seven inside handoff. The best part is, is tomorrow night he will uh, from the backside of the press box up on top of the old practice field and hmm. not have to climb stairs. That's thing, great. To watch Eli play. That's great. Yeah, Eli Hubs, his uh, his son, great football player for Gibbs. There's Derek Hunt, two state championship winning coaches, will come across and shake hands out at midfield.